Waking up during the night feeling like someone has clamped your leg? Sudden spasms causing you to trip over yourself? Ah, the joys of pregnancy induced leg cramps. Unfortunately, leg cramps during pregnancy are common and experienced by up to 50% of women. The cause of these painful episodes is uncertain, but studies suggest that lactic and pyruvic acid buildup can cause involuntary contractions. Sadly, this means that there's no surefire way to prevent leg cramps altogether, but there are some ways to reduce their occurrence and severity. In this video, I'll discuss how nutrition can impact leg cramps during pregnancy. Stay tuned. Hello, if this is our first time connecting, welcome. My name is Melanie McGrice and I'm a pre and postnatal dietitian. I help mamas have a healthy pregnancy and give their babies the best start possible with the power of good food. If you haven't subscribed, take a minute to do so, so that you don't miss out on any of my weekly nutrition tips. Now, leg cramps are a frustrating, often painful, but common problem for pregnant women, particularly during the third trimester. Cramping can occur at any time throughout the day and night, and many women report that they suffer from disrupted sleep due to nighttime cramping. There's nothing worse than being woken up with a feeling like your leg muscle is being tied in a knot. So what can we do to stop them? Some research shows that oral supplementation of magnesium can potentially reduce the occurrence of pregnancy-induced leg cramps. For example, a recent study found that the women taking the magnesium supplement reported the frequency of leg cramps to be slightly less than those in the placebo group. Other commonly prescribed supplements include calcium, B vitamins, vitamin C and vitamin D, but studies have shown each to have little to no effect. Instead, it appears that our water intake is what we should really be focusing on. Dehydration is common in pregnancy and is often responsible for the dreaded leg cramps. During the third trimester, you retain a lot of fluid, so water requirements are super high. I recommend starting the day with a large glass of water. Repeat this before every meal and in between meals. You really wanna be hitting around 12 glasses of water per day. Find a water bottle that you like and keep it with you all the time. And if you find that you're getting bored of plain water, you can always spice it up with some fresh lemon, lime or berries. So sadly, I can't promise you that you won't experience a leg cramp ever again, but I can assure you that the intensity and frequency should settle down with adequate hydration and good overall nutrition. Now, I've got a little surprise for you a free pregnancy meal plan to help you to optimize your pregnancy diet. Just go to www.melaniemcrice.com slash pregnancy and feel free to tell your friends about it too. I'll look forward to seeing you in my next video. Sorry, I still didn't get that out. Oh, come on, Melanie. Do you want to start? Uh, just, yeah, from that paragraph, I guess. <laughs>